I brought the Rogue Sport night vision system out and I've started it recording now. I brought it out in the daylight because in experimenting with it in the dark I was stumbling around a bit too much with the various dials. There are three dials. There is a zoom dial for optical zoom and then there's a wide angle to narrow angle uh, dial here and on the right hand side there is a dial for zooming your infrared light in. And I found it worked well at night, but I was just having a little more trouble. So right now, since I have it recording, I'm going to use the optical zoom. And notice that it's focused right now on the trees closest, which are about 75 feet away. Then there are trees in the background that I'm guessing are about uh, 300 feet away. And as I zoom in, uh, of course, I'll go down focus at first, but notice how close the optical zoom brings those trees in the background. And it appears to me that the trees in the foreground remain in focus even when I twist the, the focus button to bring the uh, farther trees into focus. So that's a, a very powerful uh, optical zoom. Then there is also digital zoom, which will bring you right in on the beak of a bird, I think, even on those farthest trees. Now to give you an idea of what I was seeing looking at the screen as I zoomed in, I'm going to go ahead and zoom in uh, while watching the screen with this camera. Okay, I just want to demonstrate how the infrared works. The camera is currently zoomed clear out on 1080p, pointing at a tree probably 400 yards away. And the infrared is illuminating the trees close by. Now as I zoom the infrared in, you see it doesn't get brighter, but it zooms in, it focuses. Now if I were to zoom in on that tree top there, You can see how well illuminated it is, and I'm thinking that that tree is about 400 feet from me. These are the night vision binoculars from Woe Sports. 4K Ultra HD recording, 1300 foot range. Let's open it up and see what we have. When I first opened this up, I was really impressed with the size and with the feel. Uh, and the quality and the adjustments that are available for focus and for telephoto. It actually has uh, optical zoom as well as uh, digital zoom. And so I'm looking forward to getting it out in the field and trying it out.